Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to uh, go through on how to style a mini skirt. If you're new here, hi, welcome. My name is Jeanette and I'm a blogger behind Elegance of Shea.com. I am a style blogger from Australia, Melbourne, and I've linked, left a link in my description box. Check everything is in there. So my blog, my social media, my Instagram including. Love you to come follow me. I've actually got a giveaway live going on at the moment. So if you're interested in a glass test candle for free, if you're interested, come check that out. This, um, all my Instagram, my Facebook, all my social media is all linked down below. Love you to come follow me there. Nothing like all that sort of thing. Let's get to the video. Now, mini skirt is not something I would actually wear. Especially like, usually in my style videos, they include a kind of item that I can wear and I can style differently. So like work, going out, like clubbing or drinks or something like that. Or like a brunch or like a barbecue or family event kind of thing. But mini skirts I find are quite hard for that sort of thing. So, but I want to show you how you can introduce it in your wardrobe. And style it in a classy way. That's actually my personal style. So, um, like this outfit, for example, um, some people probably wear to brunch or like a nice spring day if Melbourne ever has it. Um, so, I'd probably go to brunch on the other side of town, grab my nice little, you know, filler bag, little mini bag, put some, you know, my card wallet, keys, phone, that's pretty much it, and ready to go. And some sunnies. Um, yeah, so I'm wearing my new Voodoo stockings. They're like, a pink, I don't know if you can see all the way over there, I'm not very tall, um, so they're like, I purposely bought these stockings, I also bought two pairs the other day, so I bought it to update an all black outfit, which I will show you, um, these ones I really like to, kind of like this 50s mod kind of thing, I wish they could be black, because that's my colour palette, but they didn't, but I still like them, they're quite cute and pink, um, and they kind of balance out the fact that I'm wearing something quite short, Obviously the top, the top is quite long at the back and it just balances out the mini skirt because the mini skirt is quite short obviously. Can't see. Can you see me here? Yeah, so I thought if I wear something nice and covered up top, I kind of balance out the fact that I'm wearing something that's quite short. So this is outfit number one. Again, one to outfit number two. To outfit number two. Again, something probably a bit more dressy, probably chuck on a brooch if I was actually going out and a nice pair of glitzy heels. Um, just chuck it on with some leggings underneath, or even like a nice, nicer pair of stockings, whatever you like. Um, the nice blouse I got from Zara a while ago. Purposely got this because it's got the nice per, um, button detailing, the full button. I'll probably chuck on my new Mossman jacket that I bought and I've styled, I did another video on that. I'm actually going to link all my style videos down below, so if you want to see the playlist and, start it, and see the videos that I started with and how my editing has changed, feel free to check them out. They're quite bad, so don't judge me, please don't judge me. A nice camisole underneath it was really going to annoy me, but anyway. Um, okay, so there's something a bit more going out, like I said, statement heels, nice little belt, whatever you like. Again, something a bit more classy, it's a bit more, for me, evening means the time to be a bit more open. The daytime I find that the daytime I prefer it's a bit more covered as opposed to the nighttime because that's a time where you show that bit of sexiness to it. Because obviously I wouldn't wear this during the day unless it's a not evening event. But generally I wear this probably at night because it's a bit more open with the mini skirt as and leggings or like a nice pair of black opaque stockings, whatever you like. Nice pair of boots. It's very with my style is very transitional. I don't really go with trends. I definitely pick what I like. And um, for whatever season it is, I tend to, tend to adhere to that. So, like I said, this weather is weird at the moment in Melbourne. I don't know if anyone else is feeling like that, but this is something I'd probably wear going up. On to outfit number three. This is outfit number three. Something a bit different. Again, like I said, my style is very different. The mini skirt, same leggings, just throw on a uh, warm jumper and my new blazer I got from Mossman. I'll link this one down below. This is the Sartorial blazer, if I remember quickly. Sartorial. Some of that. Others even chose the other one. So it's got the silk lapel, and it somehow it's dressed up the the mini skirt, as you can see. The palette, color palette is generally basic, so um, it's quite black neutral. It's blacks, whites, even like sh um, soft shades of pink. And this orbe color is generally a good good thing with me too. But anyway, uh, that's my last outfit for the mini skirt. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Stay tuned. I'm um, uploading every Saturday. is definitely going to be a style video, so give you a bit of inspiration throughout the week. With more some more serious style inspiration, come follow me on my Instagram. Like I said, there is a giveaway 
go anywhere at the moment so if you can follow me there Sundays and Fridays will be uploading so don't forget to subscribe give this video hey guys I just realized I didn't actually film an ending to that video but I just want to say thank you so much for watching that video I've since then learned a bit more editing skills so I hope you enjoy don't forget to even share this video so if you really enjoyed how I style things and how I um, introduce the styling to my videos I'd love for you to share, share my video like and subscribe I'm hoping you enjoy that subscribe and show your support to my channel see you guys in my next one bye